ever wondered how to craft the perfect canola ricotta right in your kitchen? This classic Sicilian dessert, with its crisp pastry shell and creamy ricotta filling, might seem like a daunting task. But fear not, because today, you're going to discover just how simple it can be. First things first, gather your ingredients. You'll need flour, sugar, cocoa powder, butter, marsala wine, egg whites, and a pinch of salt for the shells. For the filling, you'd need ricotta cheese, powdered sugar, and chocolate chips. Also, don't forget the vegetable oil for frying. Scene script. Begin by making the dough for the shells. Combine two cups of flour, a quarter cup of sugar, and two tablespoons of cocoa powder. Stir in a quarter cup of butter, cut into small pieces, and a half cup of marsala wine. Mix everything together until a dough forms. Once the dough is ready, wrap it in plastic and let it chill in the refrigerator for about an hour. While the dough is chilling, you can start on the ricotta filling. Mix two cups of ricotta cheese with one cup of powdered sugar. Stir in a half cup of chocolate chips. Set this mixture aside. Now take the chilled dough out of the refrigerator and roll it out on a floured surface. Use a round cookie cutter to cut out circles of dough. Place each circle into a greased tart shell pan. Press the dough into the pan to form a shell shape. Bake the shells in a preheated oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for about 10, 12 minutes, or until they are firm and slightly golden. Once the shells are baked, remove them from the oven and let them cool completely. Once the shells have cooled, fill each one with a spoonful of the ricotta mixture. Smooth out the filling with the back of a spoon. To finish off the cannoli, sprinkle powdered sugar on top of each filled shell. You can also garnish with chocolate shavings or a cherry if desired. Serve the cannoli immediately or refrigerate until ready to serve. Enjoy this delicious Italian dessert. Next, roll out the dough to about an eighth of an inch thick. Cut out circles using a round cutter or a glass. Wrap each circle around a cannoli tube. Seal the edges with a bit of egg white. Now comes the fun part. Fry these shells in vegetable oil heated to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Once they're golden brown, remove them from the oil and let them cool. When the shells are cool, it's time to fill them. Use a piping bag to pipe the ricotta filling into each shell. Dust the cannoli with powdered sugar and voila, you have your homemade canolo ricotta. To summarize, crafting canolo ricotta involves making a dough from flour, sugar, cocoa, butter and marsala wine. This dough is then chilled, rolled out and shaped into tubes. The tubes are fried until golden brown, then filled with a sweet ricotta and chocolate chip mixture, and finally dusted with powdered sugar. It's a culinary journey worth embarking upon, and the result? A Sicilian delicacy that promises to impress. So there you have it, a culinary voyage to Sicily right from your kitchen. With these steps, you can turn simple ingredients into a delightful canolo ricotta. So why wait? Start your journey today and bring a piece of Sicily to your home. Enjoy the process and most importantly, enjoy your homemade canolo ricotta.